Hey there, how's it going? Well, I've wondered for a while whether we were ever going to see an end to some of the craziness that we've been seeing at college campuses, where anyone who dares to question the kinds of bullshit, especially from intersectionality, that we're seeing at college campuses, anyone who even has the slightest bit of support for Trump gets harassed, bullied, and even have violence brought against them. And in Trump's CPAC speech, he basically said he wants to sign an executive order that would stop federal funding for colleges that don't support and uphold the free speech of the students that attend the college. This is great. This is awesome. Check this out. We reject oppressive speech codes, censorship, political correctness, and every other attempt by the hard left to stop people from challenging ridiculous and dangerous ideas. These ideas are dangerous. Instead, we believe in free speech, including online and including on campus. And by the way, there's a young gentleman with us today. There's a young gentleman. I turned on my television the other day, and I saw somebody that was violently punched in the face. Violently punched. And I said, that's disgusting. By a bully, I'd like to do a lot of things, but of course, we would never do that. Because if I ever said violence, they would say, Donald Trump attacked. No, no, no. Just for the media, I'm sure he's a lovely young man. Just had a little temper tantrum. I've been there before with those people. I don't want to do it again. So, the man's name is Hayden Williams. Where's Hayden? Where is he? Where is he? Hayden, come up here, please. Thank you. Thank you. So, at the Leadership Institute, we're committed to making campuses great again, and I thank you so much for bringing me up here to let me speak. It's, it's, great, it's great that I'm being recognized, and, uh, but there, there's so many conservative students across the country who are uh, facing discrimination, harassment, and worse if they, if they dare to speak up on campus. So I'm glad that we could, uh, we could you know, bring this to the forefront. And uh, I'd just like to say, you know, if these uh, socialist progressives had their way, they would put our Constitution through, through the paper shredder in a heartbeat. So, you know, it's, it's as important now than ever to work at Leadership Institute and Campus Reform, you know, exposing these, these liberal abuses to the public. It's, 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 it's as important now as ever. And, and these, students, these students do it because they have a love of our nation. And, uh, and, and freedom, and, and frankly, I love for you, Mr. President. So if you keep defending us, we'll keep defending you. Thank you. Thank you. Stay here for a second. So here's the one thing. I was gonna call him, but I don't have to now. I see him here. But here's the one thing. I learned a number of things. First of all, he could take a punch. Muhammad Ali could take a punch. He can take a punch. Because you weren't going to go down no matter how. That was a hell of a hard punch. He was a strong guy. But you know what? You've got yourself a great lawyer. I know your lawyer. She is a great lawyer. Just tell her to do me a favor. Sue him, but he's probably got nothing. But sue him forever. But sue the college, the university. And maybe sue the state. Ladies and gentlemen, he took a hard punch in the face for all of us. Remember that. He took a punch for all of us. And we can never allow that to happen. And here is, in closing with Hayden, here's the good news. He is going to be a very wealthy young man. That's okay. <laughs> Thank you.
Go get him, Hayden. Today, I'm proud to announce that I will be very soon signing an executive order requiring colleges and universities to support free speech if they want federal research dollars. If they want our dollars, and we give it to them by the billions, they've got to allow people like Hayden and many other great young people and old people to speak, free speech. And if they don't, it will be very costly. That'll be signed very soon. So yeah, how cool is that? 